are you today? <sighs> I can relax. Jennifer from Cinnamon Stitches got her mermaid. Yay! I was so worried that it was going to get there and the tiara was going to be broken or something. And it didn't break. Because I, I bubble wrapped the crap out of it. But anyway, <laughs> you guys are all off to the side. Um, yeah, so I, I'm so glad that she's got it and she likes it. Oh, you know, I have to say, when you're doing a custom order for somebody, it's nerve wracking. It's really nerve wracking because you're thinking, oh, I hope they like it. Is this right? Do you, you know, like, oh. yeah. So she put out a video. I will leave that link down below. I already put it in my Facebook page and I put it in my community tab. <laughs> Jeez, my brain. Uh, so yeah, I'll leave it linked down below and I'll put it in the cart. I said this side. I never know. I'll put it in the card, uh, up above as well. So yeah. And I will also up in the cards and the links down below, I will put the video of me making it. So you can go check that out. Um, her video was, I, I was sitting there with my cup of coffee and I'm like, okay, because I had gotten a message from a subscriber saying the video's up and I was like, oh, right. So I, uh, I went and I, I was watching it. I started crying. Um, good tears. <laughs> um, she touched on so many different things in that video and it just, it warmed my heart so much because it really showed me that our friendship is deep. Um, that I hope I can say that Jennifer. Um, but it's, you know, it's, it's really interesting. She's totally right. Right. Like when, when she's having, uh, issues on YouTube where people are just going at her, I do. I, the minute I hear, see that video, I'm on, on camera and I'm just like, don't be messing with my Jen. Right. It's like, uh, as, 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 as everybody that loves her, um, everybody comes to her defense. I just happen to do it on camera, <laughs> whether that's good or bad. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but I do that for my YouTube friends. I did the same thing with Angela for my precious yarnery when the whole shaboggle went down um, a while back. Uh, you know, it's like I absolutely hate and I can say hate. It's a pretty strong word, but I can actually say hate the crap that goes on in the YouTube world um, and in the world, period. But on the YouTube streets, it's like it's it's like a freaking rumble sometimes it's it's stupid it's stupid we're all here to have fun we're all here to learn something uh we're all here to teach something um it, and it shouldn't be like that but unfortunately sometimes it is and it's always nice to have friends that will stand up for you and i'm not ride or die for her like i just i man if if we were ever together like physically in, not physical. If, if I was in the same room as her <laughs> um, and something went on, I'd be stepping in front. I'd be stepping in front of her and going, you have to go through me, you know, because Jennifer is such a wonderful person and I love her to bits and I'm going to start to cry if I don't stop. So. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, you know, and then she touched on, um, my empathic side and her empathic side. And it was just, it was so nice to be validated, you know? So, um, yeah, it's just, uh, it's, it's bizarre. But anyway, and then she started talking about my husband, George. And I was, I, I, I says, George, sit down. <laughs> he came in from work. And he, he's like, what? And I says, 
you gotta watch this. <laughs> so he's like, uh oh. So he sat down and he watched Jennifer talking about George. And I'm looking over. And I'm looking at the TV. And I'm looking over. <laughs> and you can see him going, hmm. <laughs> and I was like, she's not wrong. <laughs> So George is, can, George can be a bit handle, um, but he is hilarious. He makes me laugh all the time. I love him dearly. Otherwise I wouldn't have married him. Um, but yeah, sometimes when he gets on camera, it's like, like, oh, wait, what's it going to be today? <laughs> so he hasn't been on camera in quite some time. Uh, he's just, he's working stupid hours. He, honest to God, I, I kid you not, this man's a workaholic. He gets up at three o'clock in the morning, sometimes four o'clock in the, well, between three and four o'clock in the morning. Uh, and he starts working, boom, like, cause he works for DoorDash and Uber. And he also has a carpet cleaning company. But when he's not carpet cleaning, he's like on. Um, the minute his feet hit the floor, he, his app is on. And he, nine times out of 10, will get something at three o'clock in the freaking morning. Are you kidding me? Like, who's up at that time? You know, I keep thinking it's gamers or something. I don't know. But anyways, he, and he doesn't stop until sometimes eight o'clock at night. Every day. Except Sunday. When it's football, like it is now, he'll work up to like 9.30 in the morning. Then he'll watch football. Um, but when it's not football, it's every day, every day, every day. And it's like, I've never seen anybody work so bloody hard in my life. And I, I never get to see him. <laughs> Sometimes it's a good thing, but anyway, <laughs> so anyways, Jennifer touched on that. Um, but there were so many things in her video that just touched me so deeply. And she knows I, I, I'm sure now I know she knows um, how much she means to me. Uh, and yeah. So anyway, she ordered the mermaid. I made it. I sent it to her and she she loves it. And I'm just like, oh, thank God. <laughs> so anyway, she did say in the video that I don't do custom orders, which I want to edit that just a little bit. I, when I had the shop, but she said that when I had the shop, I, I stopped doing custom orders. Um, when I had the shop, the custom order, I sold more custom orders in the shop than I did regular stuff in the shop. It was getting crazy. So, and these were not small things. These were like the three foot dragon, the big octopus, the, the forest guardians, you know, so it, it took some time. Um, so I got burnt out. I got burnt out. I found, I felt like I couldn't make anything else. Like I couldn't have made a sweater because I was too busy doing custom orders and I was starting to get frustrated. So <clears throat> I stopped doing custom orders for a while to take a break. Now that I don't have the shop anymore, I can start doing custom orders again. My website is up. It's crochetacanada.ca. Now I put a flat ship rate on all of the stuff on there, whether it's big or small. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do is <sighs> the, the flat rate shipping is $30. And I know for like a small thing, it, that seems like a lot of money. Um, but what I'm going to do is when you order it, um, I'm just going to refund the amount, if the shipping is way less, then I will refund the remaining amount. That's the only way I can think of doing it because otherwise I, I'm, I have to measure and weigh everything and, and then I don't know where you're at and it's, it's just a whole thing. So maybe what I can do, oh, I just thought of this. What if I didn't, put a price on this stuff so you can't buy it on my website but you can see the different things that I'm making and then if you're interested in it and you want it custom made in different colors or whatever you can email me and tell me what you want and then we can 
um, we can pay the whole amount at that time. Maybe. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Once I find out, you know, what your address is or whatever, then I can find out, um, how much it's going to cost to ship it. Maybe I'll do it that way. But anyways, I do do custom orders now. Um, and I'm going to do them in order as I get them. Okay. So if I get 10 orders, <laughs> good Lord, um, you're going to be in a queue. Sorry. That's just the way it is. Unless I have one on hand. Um, but yeah, so I think that's what I'm going to do from now on. Uh, but anyway, um, what else? I, 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 I think I'm going to change. I, I usually do my videos on my cell phone. I think I'm going to stop doing that. I've got my cam. I have a camera that I bought specifically for videoing quite some time ago. And it has the flip screen and the whole thing. Um, this is a Canon e EOS. This thing is brand new. And I used it for a while, and then when my channel, when I when my channel was monetized, and I was able to um, use my my cell phone, I started doing that, thinking that was the better idea. <clears throat> In the past, that it wasn't such a bad thing because my cell phones back then, which is stupid, my cell phones back then had the autofocus. And I, so when I'm going up like this and I'm trying to show you the safety eyes or whatever, it focuses in and I don't know how to do that on my phone. Um, so I think I'm going to go back to using a camera so that I can autofocus because it's driving me bananas. Um, I, I absolutely, I mean, which means I got to go back to using an, an SD card and uploading it from the SD card. And it's also the memory on my phone. I'm having a hell of an issue with it. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to, I'm going to go back to that. So I don't exactly know what the sound quality is going to be. I may end up having to start using a mic, um, but I'm not going to do that until I move into the yarn room. So for now, I'm going to use my cell phone, <clears throat> but that's my, I love the, the, the way the video looks, but the zooming thing drives me freaking bananas. Um, so anyway, so that's going to change. I have other things that I want to do. Uh, so, oh, um, for the members giveaway, the Forest Guardian, I think is it has won. So I think I'm going to be making a custom Forest Guardian for my members. Um... And yeah, which is fine because I've been wanting to do a forest guardian in the mystical yarn. Uh, so yeah, I might do one up. I might do one up in the mystical yarn just to see what it's like and then go from there. I don't know. <clears throat> so anyways, that, uh, that giveaway is at the end of the month. I will probably draw, do the drawing for that on Hall Halloween or November 1st, one or the other. Um, I'm also going to be doing a giveaway on here for a custom sweater. Not sure when I'm going to get to that yet. Uh, I want to get the Forest Guardian done first. What else? I just lost my train of thought. I don't even know. <laughs> this happens a lot. I've got so many things. I, you know what? I'm going to go back to my old ways uh, and start doing different types of editing. Uh, and I'm going to have a book. And I'm going to have a book here. And I'm going to start writing down things because there are things on other people's videos that I want to talk about. And then I forget. As soon as I'm in front of the camera, I go, uh, I can't remember. So I'm going to start writing key points down like I used to. Something. <laughs> I get out of the shower. I'm blow drying my hair. 
and all of a sudden, bing, I get this idea. Something that I've noticed, and I, it's been a few years that I've really noticed this. Back in the day, <laughs> I've been on YouTube for like five years. Back in the day, there used to be a thing where if you had a live, if you were on a live, that you could do a kind of like a, a video bombing where the person that's doing the live can say, hey, if you've got a YouTube channel, put it in the comments and it would link anybody that clicked on your name. It would link you directly to that person's YouTube channel. I loved that. They don't have it anymore. And it just drives me crazy because, you know, it, it was just so nice to be able to, you know, go, oh, that person's got a YouTube channel. I'm going to go check it out. You know, there you go. Right. Um, but now in a live, you've got to drop their link in. Uh, and, you know, it's just a whole thing. It's a pain in the butt. But anyways, um, when I first started, that's how I got a lot of my subscribers in the beginning because, you know, whether it be somebody gave me a shout out and then they, my link would be there or, you know, um, like when I first started my channel, what I did was I sent different YouTubers gifts and they would give me a shout out. Shout outs aren't really a thing anymore. You know, like people will talk about other channels, you know, like, oh, I made this plushie from this thing, but it's mostly TikTok and Instagram that they're shouting out. Um, so yeah, it's not, you know, other people used to do the shout out, say a shout out Sundays or whatever. I tried that long time ago. Uh, and I don't know, like people don't give shout outs the way they used to. But then again, the community that we had even f three years ago was totally different than what it is now. Um, you know, a lot of people have dropped off, you know, a lot of people have come back, come on like newer, like, uh, younger people are on YouTube now doing the plushies and everything. And it, the, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> ever since COVID, the YouTube streets have exploded with, you know, teens to twenties, um, doing amigurumi and, and plushies. And it's just, you cannot keep track of everybody now. Like it's just insane. Um, so our little, our core people, it's, it's totally different. It's totally different. Um, I'm not entirely sure I like it, but it just feels like our whole little family disbanded and it's sad. You know, uh, my bestie Sandy Duda from left is right crochet. She doesn't do videos anymore. Um, and I'm talking to her about it. Uh, I want her to come back and do her lives. I think that it would be really good for her. And I, I know that all of her subscribers miss her terribly. So, but she's had, had so many health problems that she's just, she doesn't, she just didn't have the energy. Um, so I've been trying to talk to her to say, come back, you know, come back. We miss her and Octavia and Oscar and, you know, <clears throat> so I'm working on her guys. I'm working on her. <laughs> so anyways, you know, <clears throat> excuse me, like Granny D, I think Granny D still does videos, but you know, and, and YouTube has done this algorithm thing and everything where they've kicked people off different channels and I'm going, what the heck? It's like people I haven't, Granny D, I haven't had her videos in, I don't know how many years, you know, um, you know, like there's just, there's a lot of people that, you know, uh, and I also know that we had a few, um, that have passed away and that really rocked the world, the crochet world. So yeah, everything is changing. Um, 
I'm old school, so I don't know. I, I don't know how I feel about it. But anyway, having said that, I would like to do shout outs again. Um, and I also want to start, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I want to, I don't know. Anyways, that, that I'm not even going to talk about that right now. Um, so yeah, so I, I want to start doing shout outs. I want to start, I want to go through, actually, I want to do a video sometime where I'm showing my subscriber list and start showing you and my patterns, um, different patterns that I have and showing you who they're by and <clears throat> stuff like that and giving them shout outs because they have Etsy pages and stuff. And I'm sure that they would love for people to, you know, go to their Etsy page. So I want to kind of give back to the community, the YouTube community that we've got, um, and get back to the old ways, you know, because we could all use some help, right? Uh, Oh, I want to thank all the subscribers that came over from Jennifer's channel. Thank you so much for being here. And I really hope that you hit that subscribe button and stick around for a while <clears throat> or forever. <laughs> I've had, I have subscribers on my channel that have been here from day one and I love them so much. Um, and I, they have watched me go through so much, so much, so much. <laughs> uh, and they let me know that they're there. And I, I just love them to pieces. So I hope that you stick around. Now that I don't have my shop, I can focus on my YouTube channel. Uh, I couldn't do that for the last two years. And it just made me ill inside. <clears throat> I felt like I was letting everybody down. Um, but I just, I couldn't split myself in so many directions. But now I can sit down and I can focus on my channel. <clears throat> Excuse me. And get my channel up. My subscriber rate hopefully will go up to what I need it to be. Um, and yeah, I, uh, I got so many things you guys. I'm, I'm so energized now. I'm so, I, I, I have crocheted more since I've been, since I closed my shop than I have in a long time, a long time. And it's not just plushies, it's sweaters and and whatnot so I can get to my whips I've got this whip sitting here that's been here for ever um, that I can now finish all I got to do is the is the um, arms I've got part a part of the arm done oh and I have yarn balls running away okay <laughs> uh, you know I've got a few sweaters that all I need to do is the arms and the collar and then it's done right so I want to do that. I, yeah, there's, there's lots I need, I want to do. So I'm hoping that you guys are going to be here for my journey. Um, and if you, if you have been here for a while and you have not subscribed, please, I, I, I please just hit the subscribe button so that you can be notified. Hit the bell. Don't forget to hit the bell. And, and when you hit the bell, hit the all. Um, so then you can see, cause I've had people contact me saying, oh my God, like you've got a few videos out that I haven't seen, you know, like I had no idea that you even had those videos up. And that's probably because the notification bell and the all hasn't been clicked. Um, it just goes to a default, uh, setting when you hit the bell. So you got to make sure that you click that all. Okay. Okay. All right. So I'm going to go. I just wanted to say, you know, hello and thank you, Jennifer, for, you know, supporting me and being my friend. I love you to pieces. Mm -hmm. um, and thank, thank all the subscribers that did come over from Jennifer's channel. I really hope you stay. And I guess I will talk to you guys later. I, the next video, I will come back and I will show you the finished sweater that I'm doing. And hopefully a dragon. I've got a three foot dragon that I was supposed to make for somebody and I completely blanked it. How did I do that? I completely blanked it. So I got to start on that today and then I got to make a forest guardian.
just so that I can have it on my website. <laughs> so anyway, okay. I love you all. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.